Hello everyone, my name is Lexi and I'm from Zest Coffee. Today's video I'm going to show you how to set up a free and easy to use online ordering form for your customers. This will make everything super smooth and COVID safe. We found job form to be really customizable and easy to set up. So just sign up with your email. You'll land here at your home page and we want to create a brand new form. Job form has so many cool templates and we're going to use one of them. Find the filter over here and hit order forms. And you want to scroll down and find restaurant order form and we're going to use this template. Let's start by customizing our form. Today my cafe is going to be called Zest Cafe. This is going to be my coffee on my order form. You can add your logo up here and change some colours in the back of the form. I'm just going to leave mine for now. As you can see, this is a full menu, but I'm only going to set up a coffee menu today. So I'm actually going to delete all these items and just leave the drinks category. Just going to do this by clicking the cog here and hitting delete. Super easy. I'll be back with you once all these are gone. All right, I've deleted everything except our homemade lemonade in the drinks menu. We'll customize this, this in just a second. First, I want you to hit the settings button and create two columns. We won't enable search, this is unnecessary. We probably don't need categories either. Then just hit back and let's get started on our coffee item. Hit the pencil button. We want to change this to coffee. The price will be four dollars. I don't think we need a description today. Next, you want to uh, delete this image here and add your own. Finally, we'll change US dollars to Australian dollars. We'll show subtotal on the form and hit save. Now, a lot, a lot of people these days want some alternative milk options, so we're going to add this to the product by hitting add a product option. We'll fill in here with the milk options that we would like to offer. Scroll back up and hit create sub products from options and special pricing per option. And now you get the option to customize every options price. Take a look here. I've done the oat milk, soy milk and almond milk for an extra 50 cents. And this is now showing on our main form. Hit back and you've created your first product. Well done. Now we want to duplicate this for our medium and large sizes. So just hit the cog and hit duplicate. All right, great. Now you can see I've duplicated our small coffee to a medium and large and updated the prices for each. Before we go on, we want to set up our payment settings. You do this by hitting the small cog up the top and hit connect to connect your PayPal. Also, you want to double check that your test mode is changed to live mode and that your currency is the right one. And you want to sell products on this page. You can also choose to show uh, your debit or credit card and show PayPal options. These are really handy integrations. In this template, it uh, offers the option to do a delivery. If you don't want to offer this, it's pretty easy. You just click the section and delete it. Finally, on the build section, you've got a small blue dot here, and this is where you can choose the color scheme for your form, the theme, styles. Okay, now we wanna head over to the settings section where you'll change the name of your form and ensure your form status is enabled. The awesome about, thing about this template is that it's already got some automatic email set up that will notify you when a new order form is submitted and notify the customer of what they've ordered. You can also have the option to customize your thank you submission by uploading a new picture or customizing your own text. Finally, I wanted to show you where you can set up an approval flow. Just create a new approval flow. Again, this is all automatic. The form will be submitted. You will be sent a an approval notification and whether you approve or deny the order, it will notify the customer. Now you're ready to publish. Well done. 